In Mark 12, we meet the man that almost made it into the kingdom of heaven. Now, he was a good man, a religious teacher, a man of understanding, and the only religious teacher in this chapter that actually listened to Jesus with an open mind. He asked Jesus what he thought the greatest commandment was, and Jesus replied to love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, mind, and strength, and to love your neighbor as yourself. In this man's response, Jesus saw that this teacher not only knew the scriptures, but he understood them well. He even loved God the Father with all his heart, but Jesus still said, you're not far from the kingdom of God. So if this man listened to Jesus, if he understood Jesus, if he was moved by Jesus' words, how could he have missed heaven? Well, the pivotal point is how he addressed Jesus. See, he only saw Jesus as a gifted teacher, not as the Messiah, not as the final sacrifice for his sin, not as the way, the truth, and the life, and not as the only way to come to the Father. This thing we're doing at Coastline is not about religion, but about a relationship. Let me leave you with a verse. It's a brief exchange with someone who did make it into the kingdom of heaven. He was a thief, and in his dying moment, he realized and proclaimed that Jesus was the Savior of his soul. Listen to Luke 23, verse 42. Then he said, Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. And Jesus replied, I assure you, today you will be with me in paradise.